Hello everyone and welcome to this quick video on how to name any chemical compound in an easy way. Of course, you need to learn in organic chemistry how to name chemical compounds. But sometimes you have those questions that you cannot answer or you cannot identify the name of the compound and you just want to make sure after you, uh, you have named them according to IOPAC, there is an easy way to make sure of your answer. If you draw your uh, answer in ChemDraw, like I have uh, drawn these two compounds in here, I have drawn the first compound. If you need to know how I draw it, I just uh, uh, click on this uh, uh, tool where it will show me a bond. So then I just draw the uh, bonds of my compounds. Then the last bond here is double bond. This is when I will change my bond into double bond and I will just create these uh, two bonds. Now I need to name it from here OH. So all I have to do is stand on the edge of my uh, of my bond and when it turns into blue, I will just click the uh, uh, on the O button. Once I click it, it will give me the hydrogen because it will just try to satisfy the octet rule. Now I have this compound. I can either right click and clean my compound. This is when my compound will, uh, when I clean my compound from molecule, uh, clean up the structure, it will clean the structure in a way that it's similar to that one, a little bit organized. Now, if I need to name my structure, all I have to do is just drag, uh, right click on my structure. Once I select my structure, either using this tool or just drag, uh, drag while I'm holding the uh, right click, I can go then to the structure. Then now it will convert I have these two icons, convert name to structure or convert the structure to name. In here, I have a structure, so I need to convert it into name. All I have to just click and to give me here the name, of, the name of my compound. You could see that it named here my compound Buta 3 in because I have this double bond. Then I have one all because I have the uh, hydroxide group on the first carbon atom. Now, if I have something like this compound, which I have also stereochemistry, I, sh uh, I should uh, uh, take in into consideration. Most students name this compound uh, uh, phenol thiol, which is completely wrong because this is which is completely wrong because this is an hexa structure which uh, is uh, unsaturated, uh, uh, which is completely saturated. If it is a benzene in here, I can name it uh, phenocyol, but because this is a saturated uh, hexane, on that case, when I try to draw it, I will just click here, then I will draw the uh, hexane, then uh, either I can just uh, move it, rotate it uh, up, or I can just uh, write down one of my structure in here, so I have here uh, the uh, widget uh, hydroxide, so I will stand here until I see the OH, and I will I have also widget the thiol uh, SH where I will have the, um, I will draw it. Then uh, after that, I will just write the S and I will write down the thiol. Now I need to um, name my compound. I select my compound. In that case, I will select this one. And then I will go back to structure. Now I have convert, uh, need to convert my structure to name. And you could see it also give me the configuration if it is R or S, which is much easier for me. Um, of course, I need to know how to name according to IOBAC, but this is a quick way of making sure that you name your compounds in the right way. So in here, you could see that I can name uh, my structure. What if I have a name and I need a structure? Usually, most people go to Google and they Google the name of their compound. Or an easy way, if I go to the structure, convert name to structure, it will give me here like uh, a dialogue where I can just put the name of my compound. So if like in here, I will just write down the name of the compound on the top. So I have here one R. Now, if I click OK, it will just draw my structure. So you could see it's the same structure, uh, different position, but it's the same way and numbering. So here in one, two, and here is one, two as well. So this is uh, uh, this was a quick tutorial on how when you click uh, convert structure to name or name to structure by just clicking the structure icon uh, and you will find this uh, option convert name to structure or convert uh, structure to name. I will provide a link in the description of the video. I will provide a link on the description of the video 
for the site that you can download the, the Kim Drew from and it's for free uh, it's like uh, for free and you can just download it if you like their page and it's nice but you need to know one thing this is a Kim Drew Ultra this is where I have this uh, this structure uh, tab which give me this option on naming my structure of course there are a few other versions that doesn't provide you with this tab uh, this is why you need to download this um, uh, kindrew ultra thank you and goodbye